Midland Lutheran College, where students come to learn, live, and lead the way. I love the community here. I love the people here. Every day, I wear this nice bracelet on my hand that says Midland Lutheran College, established 1883. Just as a reminder how blessed I am to come to a wonderful college like this. As Midland marks its 125th anniversary, we have many reasons to be thankful. Midland is a place that you're going to remember for the rest of your life. Whether you step on campus here once or twice, or you're here every single day for four years. One hundred twenty-five years of preparing students to lead a moral and successful life. And I would say success is not just in their job, but it's in how they feel about themselves, how they relate to the world, how they can respond to the needs of the future and be a, a very worthwhile citizen. It's a college where faith plays an important role. A college where the football team goes to church together every Sunday. And it's just brought our team unit together. Uh, we've talked about faith uh, more than we ever have before in the past. and. Uh, Overall, it, it's, it's showed on the football field and in their personal life. Helping students mature in their faith, expand their education, and serve their community, it's what Midland is all about. One, two, three, three! But in order to maintain that high level of excellence in a competitive market, Midland is asking for your help. People who have been here a long time who care so much for this place realize that this is a, a, a point in the history of Midland where this campaign can really make a difference. The campaign for Midland Lutheran is focused on three major areas, enhancing academic programs, expanding endowments, and improving campus facilities. We have such a fabulous heritage and we have so much to work with here. It's a beautiful campus and it is a quality environment that I think is just right for those students who, who will come to our college. And Midland is taking bold steps to prepare those students, like adding graduate programs, helping adults complete their degrees through the IMPACT program and offering classes to students online. These advances require funding. This is an exciting moment in the life of our college and I think one of the things that this campaign is doing for us here at Midland is it really is forcing us to take a hard look at what are we to be about. Increasing the endowment at Midland is vital. It will generate sustainable resources for important programs like scholarships, this year, Midland is providing $8 million in scholarships, all of it unfunded. Meaning that um, it is a discount to our students to make this institution attractive, to make this institution affordable. This one's basic, and then this one's more acidic. The endowment will provide opportunities for Midland's faculty, too, with funding for professional development. It makes us more competitive in hiring better qualified faculty, and it also makes us absolutely more competitive in drawing more academically equipped students. And both of those things give the college a higher quality academic standing. It's become very difficult to compete for students. Uh, it's becoming much more demanding, the competition for students. And so we need to continue to show prospective students that we're actually a step ahead of the other schools that, that they're looking at and that they're thinking about going to. Endowment funds will also focus on improving and maintaining Midland's beautiful campus. There are hundreds of trees, plants, and flowers. The college is part of the Nebraska Statewide Arboretum. The Arboretum, when people come in, is really the front door to the campus, and you can only make a first impression once. So I consider the Arboretum, the grounds, our first impression, our front door. Once inside that front door, you can't miss the Swanson Hall of Science. It's one of the principal classroom buildings. Although it's well-maintained, Swanson is in need of serious updating. It was built in 1964. Uh, this lab, for instance, students work in pairs typically, but the way it's set up, they're not always interacting in larger groups as easily as they could if we had things arranged differently. And very little science happens on an individual basis anymore. Science is almost always done in collaboration with other scientists. The update will give students access to sophisticated labs and cutting edge technology. So that they can become the best that they can be to go out after they leave Midland and really lead in those professions. The Swanson renovation will help attract more students to Midland, as will the plan to modernize student housing. Men's Memorial is filled with history, but age and use have taken their toll. 
Students today want apartment-style residence halls, like Lund and Atchison halls. It makes a huge impression. They're worried about leaving home for the first time, and so seeing where their new home is going to be is an automatic comfort factor for them. If they feel comfortable in it before they've even lived there, they're going to be good to go. I will tell you, if the dorms aren't clean, if the dorms aren't nice, if our technology system is not above what they had at the high school level, it's going to be much harder to get the students to come. The investments made in Midland will impact Fremont too. The college pumps millions of dollars into the local economy each year. What's good for Midland is good for Fremont. It's something that I think maybe we in Fremont don't think much of, as much about as we should, but it really is huge. And I can't imagine Fremont without Midland College. I think Midland is just a wonderful asset to our community and to those that, that attend college here. Making Midland's next 125 years better than ever is what this campaign is all about. Your support will impact generations to come. Because it'll be used as well as any gift could be used to strengthen a good institution and uh, build on it. Unfortunately in the real world the private education is costing more and more and you, you need dollars to, to operate and do those little things that make that little extra special education that you get here at Midland. I think it's a wise investment. I think it's not, it's not just a donation, I think it's an investment. An investment in the future of the college, an investment in the community, an investment in our students. I just feel strongly that this campaign is going to be part of that overall program that's going to make this college just jump forward. You know, we're called in life to give as we have been blessed and we have received. We are, we are called to give and, and there's joy in that. We are asking you to join this important effort to make Midland Lutheran College a priority. Your gift will directly impact the lives of our dedicated faculty, staff, and students. Together, we can enhance the education and faith formation for all who walk this campus. And I think we can do that really out of a spirit of thanksgiving because so many have done so much for us. So why would we not want to be thankful and give the best to the future? A future of learning, living, and leading the way. Midland Lutheran College. Yeah.